Every single the electric spindle done monthly, very important. First, we have to jog our head of the machine all the way forward so when we open the doors we are able to access the electric spindle. To do that, we have to select the y-axis right here, make sure the manual movement is selected, so manual movement, make sure that we have power on the machine with the green light and then we can go all the way down and click jog fast and hold the plus button. As we are holding the plus button, the machine will start moving. So just get it close. All the way, the machine will stop by itself. So okay. Just, just keep holding it, the machine will stop by itself. Okay. Once the hand is there, we can rotate the key to tell the machine the machine is now in the tooling and now the doors are unlocked. Okay, so, so this key right here in that position locks it kind of? Unlocks it. Unlocks so it. We are unlocking these doors. Okay. Otherwise we won't be able to open them. Yeah. So we got the doors open. If we have the tool already inside, like we have now, we have to remove it. We are removing the tool with the remote control by holding the blue button. So if I have to secure the tool first, then I push the blue button and then unlocks, it unlocks my tool. Okay. Now I have the access to the electro spindle itself. This is where I want to grease. This is a special grease, Metaflux grease. It has to be a Metaflux high temperature grease. We are, I usually use the finger. You can use whatever you want to apply the, the grease there. The amount of grease has to be this much, not more than that. Just a dab. Just a dab. Very small dab. Then I hold the button to push the pin down. So by holding the button, the pin is down. Now I can go around it and grease it. I'll just go around. I see. You're holding the button. I'm holding the down. button. Then once I'm done, I just release the button and press again a couple times. I see. Now I hold it so it's open and I can put back my tool inside. Insert the tool, keep make sure the tool is all the way up and let, let go of the button. Rotate, see if everything is okay, if it's sliding perfectly. Done. I see. Where do you typically keep the grease in your toolbox? In your toolbox, but always try to put it in a separate plastic, in a plastic bag just to prevent the dust from actually going inside. Closing the doors. Turning back the key to the neutral position and then hitting the power button to make sure that everything is okay. Done. Okay.